From putting the squeeze on victims to invasive species in Florida, here are 14 striking facts about python snakes. Number 14. Living Large since this family of non-venomous serpents inhabits regions of Asia, Africa and Australia, they are identified as old world snakes. There are upwards of 41 species that are currently recognised, depending upon which source you quote. All sources agree that these reptiles include some of the largest snakes on the planet. That includes the reticulated python, which ranks as both the world's longest snake and reptile. Pythons are famous, or infamous, for killing their prey by using constriction. But first, they snare the victim with their backward curving teeth to keep a firm grip on it. Then the snakes coil around the prey which is suffocated and dies from cardiac arrest. Once it's dead, the python will typically swallow it whole. Number 13. Seeking Shelter Pythons tend to favour habitats that are warm and wet, like rainforests. But some of them can be found in grasslands, woodlands, dunes and swamps among other places. Depending on the species, they'll seek shelter underneath rocks or in burrows that have been abandoned by mammals. Since humans have been encroaching on python habitats, the snakes have also adapted to living within urban environments, as well as farmlands. One species has made a permanent home for itself in Florida, where the climate is similar to the swamps of Southeast Asia. That's the Burmese python, which is waiting for you further down the list. Number 12. Python Cuisine Rodents and lizards will satisfy smaller pythons, but larger species will take down larger mammals like monkeys, wallabies and antelopes. There are reports that some of them have been found with small leopards in their bellies. If you're hungry to know if humans are among those mammals on the menu, you'll have to hang around to find out. Number 11. Anthill Pythons while we mentioned that the python family contains some of the world's largest snakes, they also have some small members as well. The anthill python is the smallest of the lot. Also known as a pygmy python, it's native to Western Australia. Its common name is a reference to the reptile's habit of raiding termite mounds to feed on the insects. They can measure around 20 inches long, 50 centimeters, and weigh a little over 7 ounces, that's 210 grams. Due to its small size, they're very popular in the exotic pet trade. Some other small pythons include the spotted python found in Oz and New Guinea. They measure about 55 inches long, 140 centimetres. And the children's python, also from here in Oz, goes about 3 feet long or 1 metre. FYI, it's named after a British zoologist named John George Children. Number 10. Undercover Pythons are typically ambush predators that will remain motionless and camouflaged until suddenly striking when prey is within range. Camouflage is enhanced by their colouring. Depending on the size and species, the animal's coloration will vary according to their local habitat. It can range from intricately patterned scales like that of the Burmese python, to solid brown, to a vibrant green hue like that of the green tree python. That species will stay hidden in leafy high forest branches, and then lash out at birds when they fly past. Number 9. Distinguishing Features Regardless of their length or colour, all pythons have several physical traits in common. That includes backward curving teeth that are sharp enough to snare prey. Their heads have a distinctly triangular shape. A few differences within the family include the prehensile tails possessed by tree-dwelling pythons. Not all python species have pits lining the upper or lower lips that register heat and aid in locating warm-blooded prey. That trait is not found with those pythons that prey mostly upon cold-blooded creatures. Number 8. Primitive Pythons Pythons get this designation for a couple of reasons. They possess two functioning lungs while most snakes only have one. And pythons show the remnants of primitive legs referred to as pelvic spurs. It's evidence that these creatures once had four legs, and it's a trait they share with boa constrictors. In fact, the two species are sometimes confused with each other. But a major difference between the two is the fact that boas give birth to live young while pythons lay eggs. Number 7. Slow Locomotion 
Due to the size of larger specimens, they tend to move forward in a straight line. That's as opposed to the more familiar S pattern seen with most snakes. Pythons will lift their abdomens and move forward while pushing their ribs against the ground. It's a process that's formally called rectilinear progression. That adds up to a top speed of about 1 mile per hour or 1.6 k's. It's a big reason why these snakes are ambush hunters, because so many animals can easily outrace them. Number 6. Pythons as prey While pythons are renowned as predators, they can also be the prey of other animals. Creatures including insects, spiders, wild dogs and hyenas can pose a danger to them when they're young. As adults, pythons are at risk from leopards, lions and birds of prey. The most convenient time to attack a python is right after they've consumed a large meal. That's when they're far less inclined to move swiftly. Should the serpents be attacked, they will sometimes roll into a ball and stick their head in the coils. Some species might attempt to assume an S-shaped position to strike at an enemy or constrict them if possible. Number 5. Rock Python Exceptionally large specimens can weigh over 200 pounds, that's 90 kilograms, and measure more than 24 feet, that's 7.5 meters. They're the biggest snakes found in Africa, where they occur from near deserts to forest habitats. The animals grow larger in isolated regions and are known to prey on crocodiles, in addition to warthogs and spotted hyenas. While attacks upon humans have been documented, the occurrences are rare. But incidents stemming from the late 1970s to the early 21st century confirm that the reptiles are responsible for several human deaths that range from South Africa to North America. In Hampshire, England, a pet African rock python managed to escape containment and kill its owner in 2017. We couldn't find any cases verified where one of these creatures has consumed a human, but experts say that larger specimens of rock pythons wouldn't have much trouble taking down an adult. That's a valid concern in the Florida Everglades, where these beasts are starting to appear in the wild. Number 4. Bull Python after that segment on rock pythons, it seems as though keeping these critters as pets can be hazardous to your health. But a good choice for a pet python might be the ball python. They're known for being docile enough to wear as jewellery. Their name is a reference to the snake's habit of rolling itself into a tight ball whenever it's threatened. They're commonly bred in captivity and they're available in hundreds of colour morphs, including albino. So, just a thought if you're looking for a pet python. Maybe you could name it Monty. Number 3. Burmese Pythons While we mentioned that pythons are old world snakes, that doesn't mean they can't be found elsewhere. Burmese pythons are one of the world's five largest snake species, growing close to 20 feet long or 6 meters. And they've been introduced to various places in the New World, with Florida likely being ground zero. Many of those reptiles escaped containment at a breeding facility when Hurricane Andrew struck the Sunshine State in 1992. Other factors include pet owners who decided to release their animals into the wild after they grew too large to keep. Since then, the snakes have been breeding in the wild with more than 1,300 of them captured so far. Due to their large size and lack of predators, experts say the pythons are ravaging wildlife native to the Everglades, including the American alligator. Populations of rabbits, foxes and deer have been falling dramatically in areas where the snakes have been reported. It's an indication that the invasive reptiles are a hazard to the ecological balance of the Florida Everglades. Number 2. Python's Pleasure to give you a more graphic example of the danger that Burmese pythons can present to indigenous species of the Everglades, consider this. In 2015, one of the pythons managed to chow down a white-tailed deer that weighed more than the reptile itself. While the python weighed about 32 pounds or 15 kilograms, the fawn weighed 35 pounds, 16 kilograms. Experts say that regarding predator to prey ratio, this is possibly the largest ever documented for any snake species. Number 1. Main Courses Earlier in the list, we asked if you ever wondered whether humans had been eaten by pythons. Well, the answer is yes, and we found a couple of cases. 
In 2017, a 20-foot, 6-metre reticulated python was verified to have consumed a 25-year-old man in a remote village of Indonesia. After he had gone missing for several days, a python with a massive bulge in its belly was found in his garden. When neighbours opened up the reptile, the corpse of the man was found inside. About a year later, a woman had reportedly been eaten by another python in Indonesia. This beast measured some 23 feet long or 7 metres. As with the other victim, the woman's corpse was found inside the animal, fully intact. Experts say that the predatory behaviour of these snakes could be the result of habitat destruction, forcing them into areas populated by humans. Let us know what you think in the comments below. And for more epic wildlife goodness, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell for notifications for our next video. Have a great day!